Carolyn Fulham. About four and a half years ago, God gave me a small glimpse into this moment before us. Me staring at my perfect bride on this beautiful day. We were at church one day sitting together before the unexpected happened. I asked myself, can I see my life with this really pretty girl I'm sitting with? <laughs> Suddenly, he showed me that I could. The movie reel played through my daydream theater as I pictured us living happily ever after. Then reality hit as I realized that the girl of my dreams, the only girl worth fighting for, was right before my eyes. Proverbs 18.22 says, He who finds a wife finds what is good and receives favor from the Lord. This is the scripture inscribed on the ring I'll be wearing for the rest of my days. And this verse is an eternal reminder that even when life can turn into everything I never expected it to be, you are forever my good thing. And you are the physical embodiment of God's never-ending favor on my life. Con todo mi mente, mi alma y fuerza, por siempre te amo, mi amor. Michael, four years ago on this exact evening, I remember feeling the way I kind of do now. I was nervous and slightly overwhelmed at all of the people staring at us, but in that moment, right before I became your girlfriend, you looked at me and said, it's okay, just pretend like I'm the only one here. So that's what I'm going to do right now. In that moment, I knew this guy will probably be the man I marry. Actually, scratch that. I knew it when Pastor Carl handed me a letter from you. <laughs> My high school English teacher always told me that rain on a wedding day is a good thing. And when I woke up at 4.30 in the morning and saw a 90% chance of rain, <laughs> that's when I wrote this card. I happen to think it's a great thing. Because if there's one thing I've learned from you, Michael, it's the art of dancing in the rain. The art of free falling into God's grace despite what circumstances might say. So here in this moment, I vow to be your dance partner for life, to let you lead as you're led by Christ, and with every step together, to keep getting better. Why trust luck when your entire friends or family, friends and family are banded here together to help make this day the most special that it could be or could have been otherwise? Luck is up to chance. You two are more than that. You're more than spotting a shooting star, winning the lotto, or a breezy sunny day in Florida. You two have created your own destiny. You have chosen each other and I myself am happy to say to you both, congratulations on your marriage, because why trust luck?
So no matter what, always be reminded for your love. See, that's, that's, that's God. You know, it's God's love for us. And like how he's so gracious. <laughs> but always be reminded to each other that no matter what, no matter what, it's going to be okay. You guys love each other and you guys are in this together forever. All right? I love you guys. Congratulations. It's hard to believe your big day is here. Hang on, let me just wipe away this tear. I have loved you since that day we first brought you home, all bundled and wrapped like my sweet little gnome. Over the years, I was amazed by everything you would do, but I wasn't prepared for how quickly you grew. While I will always cherish these memories from our past, despite your growing up way too fast, I can't wait to see what adventures await as you and your husband, Michael, proceed out that gate. And know that you will always be the sweet little girl by my side. But today, I am thrilled to celebrate my daughter, 